Good day people and welcome back to the channel. Today I have caught a nice little thing. It's, it's a bit of an update because a while ago I did a video where I showed you how to do things to happen on specific scenes. So when you switch to your just chatting scene, you wanted XYZ to happen. You, when you switch to your game screen, you want XYZ to happen. And the way I showed you was with a lot of ifs. Now, since upstream has been evolved and updated, the if statements have slightly changed. Now, the code still works because obviously I've, I've been using mine until recently, until I did this version, it still worked. But I found a nice cleaner version and how, how, how to do it. So I thought I'd share with you. So obviously what you're gonna need, you're gonna need Streamer Bot, you're gonna need OBS, you're gonna need everything. So let's switch over to the recording other screen and I'll show you what I've done. So as you can see here, I've got an OBS in the background and I've got a Streamer Bot at the front. And I've got three actions. I've got a scene switch one, I've got a tower game one, and a display one. And with scenes, as you can see, um, there's a starting, a tower game, and display. So, scene switch is just a get current scene. I know there's other ways to get the current scene, but I like this way. It seems to work for me nicely. Um, if you have any problem with that, then let me know, and I'll see if we can guide you if you have any problems with that. But this seems to work for me. And then you've got, I've got some code. Now this code literally just gets the scene into streaming bot and it runs an action based on what scene you're on. And this code will be in the description. So and it should just compile straight out the bat, no issues. So what you need to do is once you've created this scene switch act, this scene switch action, is you need to tie it to your switch scene event in OBS. So if we go over to stream apps, you can see there's my OBS, we'll click on that. And as you see down at the bottom, I've got switch scenes and I've tied it to this scene switch action. So a lot of switch, a lot of scenes, but that's what it does. So if we go over to actions, we're gonna say, well, what does it do? Well, if you can see in, in display here, all it's gonna say is, is send out a message and same for the tile game one. So if we go over to my OBS and we switch on to starting, Nothing goes into chat, but we press tower game, you see it posts, and we go display, it posts, go back to tower game, it posts, go back to display, it posts. So what it's doing is it's reading it and running the action. So this is where you put your creativity in it. You create an action that's called exactly the same as the scene. And then anything you want to happen when you switch to that scene, i.e. channel point to disabled, Channel points become active, commands become disabled, commands become active. Um, your camera moves. Like I, I use mine basically so that when I'm on my just chatting, I can have my camera up nice and big with my chat next to me. And then once I go onto my display screen, my my camera goes down to the bottom corner. That is how I use it. So you can put whatever you want in here. And using the sub action, it's nice and easy, nice and clean. And then you know. Well, hold on, something's not happening right when I go to display screen, so then you know where to find it. It's nice and easy. What I will do is actually is put this this whole little import in the in the below, so you can see what I've done. And it should make it a little bit easier. Obviously, you'll have to delete these because you won't have a display screen or a tower game screen. So, that is it. If... If you've liked these videos, these tutorials, do consider subscribing, do consider pressing that like button and let me know in the comments below what you think and, and how you're going to use it because it's nice to see how people would use 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 this scene switch thing. Um, I do do a lot of this building on stream so if you do want to check me out you can do at twitch.tv forward slash terrier darts where I will answer questions best I can and I will if, if it's something I can show you there I will show you there and build for you and yeah but until next time I'm going to see you all later